I am trying out a new wig. It's a headband wig. How amazing. It looks so natural. It's so pretty. I love it. Um, it's from Nadula Hair. And who is she? Who? Oh! <laughs> it is so cute. I really love it. I am working right now. I just quickly had to run downstairs to grab my cell phone. I'm doing some training videos this morning. Do not mind this back there. I might paint it tonight. I don't know. Today is going to just be filled with a lot of errands because I want to start purchasing items for my birthday party that's happening on Saturday. It's Wednesday right now. It is so foggy and ugly outside, but I think my 30 minute, 30 minute like walk today will be that. Maybe I'll try to get my eye appointment too because I do my optometry appointments at Costco as well. It, it all just like fits right in. The only issue is last time I did that and I walked around Costco, my vision was blurry. I was like, where do I go? So I have to think about it, but welcome to today's vlog. I just have like a full work day going pretty strong and heavy. I have a lot of things to get done. And it's just so nice having the Christmas tree going right now. I think we're going to decorate tomorrow night. And then we have photos to take because we want to get Christmas cards as favors for friends. So we're going to actually print out our, I guess, kind of like Christmas photos together we haven't done them yet we were supposed to do them last year and then it was a whole thing so I think this year we're going to get our Christmas photos done do something really cute and we'll see how it goes but honestly I'm loving this hair headband wigs in my opinion are elite they are such a good beginner wig I really love them I did purchase a glueless like um a glueless wig from Nadula as well if you want to see me try that on let me know this is my first time purchasing from Nadula and it is amazing. The application was super easy. I don't do edges at all. I'm just not a huge fan of that look. So I just like actually flip the headband up. Like you can see here. This is what it looks like just as is. And then I flip the headband up. And then now I just look like a little Pilates girly with my suit. And I feel adorable today. I have some meetings later on. So I'm just going to put on my like matching little jacket moment onto my outfit but for right now after baths I just find that I'm I'm just warm and I need to cool off I don't have any packages well actually I have some pretty exciting packages coming today so once again just like every video we're gonna do some more unboxing that's just how it is in December after Black Friday I don't do a lot of shopping throughout the year but this time of year into January I do core shopping and then nothing at all for most of the year so you're gonna see some pretty cute things come through, but I gotta get back to work. Just got off of the phone with my best friend Desiree. I was just on FaceTime with her. I miss her to bits and pieces. She's in Dubai, but it reminded me that we have an unboxing today to do from Hover Air. I purchased this myself. I was reminded because I encouraged her to get this drone. Oh, I have to put my phone on do not disturb. I encouraged her to get this drone because it's really great for content. I saw a YouTuber, Antoinette, who I'm a fan of. I will link her channel in the cards or below. Um, she, this drone company had actually sponsored her and then I did so much research and I was like, oh my God, I need this drone, but it was pretty pricey <laughs> and I figured, let me just wait for Black Friday, see if they have a sale and they did. There was a sale on Amazon and then there was a sale on the Hover Air website directly. So I purchased it directly, um, since the sale on their website was a bit better, but she got hers on Amazon so that she could get it right away. So I'll link it from Amazon down below and 
it's a really cool drone when I saw oh, my it's a really cool drone um when I saw Antoinette post it she showed some like sample videos that she could do so she was able to walk around her home and it would follow her automatically and it was just super cool so I want to unbox that with all of you Ooh. It also comes with an extra battery which is really great and I'm happy about that so it comes with two batteries the drone itself which is great and I keep saying great why do I keep doing that I'm something's going on anywho maybe I just need more tea let's just start with the smaller things it's just this little foamy thing and just battery Jesus can I do it from the bottom there we go so the battery charger charger how do I even use this though this is cute but oh and then there's a USB C there's a USB C charger so I'll just I guess use my <laughs> computer cords maybe for boxing day I'll get some more USB chargers oh there we go one of the batteries wow it's beautiful all right that was not intentional how will we kiss? Where will we buy the drone? So my best friend, she is in Dubai right now. She's there on a solo trip, but there are people she knows who are also out there. She knows this DJ who's out there. She's hosting an event and there are a few people from Toronto who are there. And she was like, you know what? Let me just make a trip out of it. I'm sure that you will see her in future videos that I create. I'm just, I, okay. Alicia, let's just, okay. They say before your first flight, fly outdoor for a better flying experience and use it in a well-lit environment, so not at night. So these are the instructions on how to use it, which is just place it horizontally in the palm of your hand, press the power button, and then um, withdraw your hand. So you just move your hand down when it's time for takeoff. That's really cool. And then when it returns to the takeoff position, then you put your hand 20 centimeters below it and then keep still. Alrighty, that's cool. This will be really cool for like bike rides and stuff in Vancouver. And I do that pretty often. Before I even peek at the drone, I want to obviously get the instructions going. Oh great, there's an app as well. You just hit the QR code and then it pushes you to download the app. Nice, hopefully the warranty automatically goes with that too. Now this is the drone itself and how it comes. It comes very small, which is really nice to see. You just open her like this. Before takeoff, you hold it in your hand like that, and then whoop, it flies up. Why did I, okay, my sound effects. I love it. And then also in the box, in the final section, is the little hanky for it. Oh, great, and it comes with its charger, or at least the little USB cord for charging it. The batteries that is i'm going to get to using that i do kind of hate when they come with usb-c to usb because just make it usb just let it do its thing like it's okay or let it be usb-c because that's what everyone's using nowadays i want to see if the drone itself so right here if the battery pack and everything will fit with it it does that's great and then the cord love it so it can all transport together i know what i oh it already has some battery. Ah! Accidentally hit it. So I'm like, what? Before you use, you have to charge. I do know that, but I was like, let me be a little, I want it to be a little wrapped and just use it. But I'm trying to see how that, oh, okay. So the battery just pops, battery just pops right out and straight into the charger. I love that it comes with two batteries because it is not really the longest lasting drone on the planet. And here on the under underside, you can actually see the camera itself. So there's this camera here, one here. I guess that might be a sensor instead of a camera. And all of the little fans or propellers. Oh, they're so cute. I'm going to charge this for a little bit. And then if I have time, I will test flying her out. In terms of what errands we're going to run, it's grocery shopping for my birthday party. And I think that's it. Grocery shopping for my birthday party. And then just doing a lot of cleaning in the house. And because tomorrow night I have plans and then Friday night I have plans. So I wanna make sure that I get as much done as I can tonight. 
So I might be baking and doing some Christmas cookies, part of me letting them cool and then putting them in their jars. I think I'm gonna do like little Christmas sugar cookie rolls because I remember I said I wanted to get rid of a bunch of glass jars. I might have mentioned that a few vlogs back. Instead of me putting them on the Facebook free neighborhood thing, I'm going to give them to my friends. Love you all. <laughs> what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a gift out of the Christmas cookies that I make. I'm gonna just make a bunch of really little ones and give them away to my friends, but give them away in the glass jars so they have to take them. I need them out of my house. I can't anymore with them. We're finished with them. They, I have no use for them anymore. I loved using glass jars for recipes and different stuff, but it just started cluttering my cabinets. I don't like the thinner mouthed ones. I only like the wider mouthed ones. So I'm getting rid of all the ones that are smaller mouths and giving them to my friends for Christmas and writing them cute little notes on them. Hopefully they'll take them all or most of them. And then I only have a few more to deal with. Oh, I think I have a meeting. Today for my OOTD, I'm wearing this bodysuit from Lululemon. It's the, the Align bodysuit. It's super cute. It's just the tank top one. And then in espresso, really cute. And I'm wearing it with the Nulu. I have the tag. Define, define cropped jacket in Nulu. Let's also talk about my boots. So in yesterday's vlog, I went to Little Burgundy and I bought my boots exchanged. Let's talk about it. When I went there, I went there to get my Sorrells. I purchased a new pair of boots. They're amazing, but I still have the same issue. I asked for new boots. I just wanted boots that nobody had tried on, nobody had bought and returned or anything like that. And it felt, are you kidding me? There's still a little like, I'm annoyed, but whatever. I just wanted these boots not tried on or anything. Like there's even threads that are coming a part of this boot. It's not the quality of the boot. It's just that at Little Burgundy, they just, have like the display shoes but everyone's tried them on I don't get it these were the only shoes or at least the only ones I was given where the cardboard wasn't out nobody helped me really I just went up to the person I said hey you put two boots on hold for me may I try on the nine and a half and may I see the nine she's like yeah just drop the boots off and like disappeared and I was like okay so I went on to see no questions asked Nobody said, like, are these fitting okay? Do you need a different pair? Like, she was just so whatever. And then I went to the front and I said, hi, do you have another pair that haven't been worn or used? Because even these ones that I went to try on, they were still not new. She's like, oh, okay, one second. Still brought me boots that were not new. They were new enough. It was frustrating. And then now I also have to clip see that there's like some thread here on this one yeah this thread is broken but these boots I will say seem to be worth the journey they are so comfortable they are stunning and they are waterproof waterproof they are the little burgundy brex I think I'll as usual ooh, I'll link them down below little burgundy uh, or sorel brex boot they're waterproof they are leather and they have look at that tread on the bottom and you will see me wear them throughout the season as well they were so comfortable like i'm gonna put them back on okay. they were super comfortable with socks and without socks the nine and a half was just a little bit too big but they are super cute can't wait to wear them i have to use the bathroom oh my god oh my god oh my god it's here. I don't care that my fingers are so cold and that my body has been shivering. I'm about to have my favorite. I have been waiting. I've been waiting since I got back from Mexico earlier this month for this. It is the boba tea protein drink. It's everything, everything. I ordered three of them. I loved it so much that I ordered three. This morning, I was so sad that I didn't have this drink more than any other morning, and it's here! Yes! All right, I'm gonna open it. When I say the, the excitement I felt when I received that alert, the excitement I felt when I got that alert that my protein was here, 
Now, here's what makes it special. It's actually boba tea protein. So this is a milk, like a pearl milk tea, except there's no pearls in it. And what makes it super special is it's made with monk fruit. So it's sugar-free and very low in calories. I ordered three of the classic milk tea. And then I also ordered the Thai tea for my boyfriend. So he really wanted to try it. I'm so happy it's finally here. And I'm gonna show you how I make mine. I do not make it in a low pro or a low calorie way at all. It is so decadent, but I have it once a day in the morning because I have a slower start. I start my work day at six, which is super early. And that means I get up very early and I'm not always ready to have breakfast at that time. If I have breakfast prepped, sure, but I'm not always ready to have breakfast at that time. So I like to have this. So I get in how many? 25 grams of protein, zero sugar, and it has a bit of caffeine in it as well. I'm not really a big caffeine fan, but this is worth it. This is worth it. Oh, I'm so happy. All right, this is the tea. A good tea. <laughs> I feel like I'm talking to my friends with one. I'm like, girl, the tea. But this, this is the tea, and it's it's everything. I really recommend it if you're looking to increase your protein at all, and you're just like a pretty big tea fan. Then this is 100% for you. I'm obsessed with it. I just order pearls, so my boyfriend he likes to drink this with pearls, so I can just boil the pearls and make them myself but I'll just show you how I make mine. It's everything. I literally got three of them. So they had a Black Friday sale. I will link this down below. I'm gonna try to reach out to their team for a promo code for you all maybe. It's that good. I am so happy. I'm gonna show you how I make my boba tea protein. This is my recipe. And this is, I would contribute, like attribute this as to why I've been able to lose weight so quickly over the last bit without doing extreme exercise or anything like that i've just been focusing on as low sugar as i can do but still enjoying the things that i want to eat and drink and whatever zero sugar for this i do one scoop of the protein oh my god i have to find the scoopy oh wait, there it is i found it Ugh. i hate this feeling of diving into it one scoop oh my god it's like in there and then I use my immersion blender and I just blendy blend. Into my influencer glass. Look it. Oh, it's so creamy. It's so delish. Absolutely amazing. I love it so much. I really recommend it with a heavier milk. For me, at least. I love it. With the one cup of milk, I think that it's a total of about 300 calories for this. But I only have one per day. And it, it keeps me full for so long. And it's just so convenient. So, cheers! Let's try to get this drum to work. Oh, let's press and hold the power button. So that's happening. Nice. It's downloading an update. Almost finished. The update, it's gonna be like blue. Oh my god, it's. It, this might take me 10 minutes, so I'm gonna start lunch. 